One of the things about selling luxury real estate is, yeah, you have the house and the property, but then you gotta fill it with furniture and people are just totally underestimate how much furniture costs. So today we're gonna play a fun game where we guess how much furniture costs to house a home. And this is common. In luxury homes and many markets, you have the option to purchase furniture. So today, we're gonna guess with a couple contestants. Let's get started. All right, so this is gonna be so much fun. I am so excited. So today we're gonna play Price is Right. And that's how we're gonna try to figure out like what each individual room costs to furnish. And this is gonna be a fun game. Let's just go dive right back into how Price is Right rules work. You have to get as close to the price as you can with not going over the price. So joining me today, the two contestants are the renowned Brooke, an interior designer. You gotta follow her Instagram, it's great by the way. And my colleague and YouTube extraordinaire, Emily Farber. So, Emily is currently at her house trying to shop for furniture for her new house and she's shocked at how much furniture costs. And that's kind of the point of us doing this today is furniture costs more than you think. So, I'm excited to get started. Remember again, you wanna guess as close as you can to the price without going over. We're gonna go room by room before we do. We're gonna go from the dining room, to the kitchen, to the sitting room, to the living room, the study, the foyer, and in the bedroom. How much do you think it costs to furnish all these rooms? Just take a wild guess. This is just a bonus round. All of them at once? You're, you're really gonna make me show my penny-pinching heart here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, knowing that it's Adam, who likes very nice things, all of those rooms, I'm gonna say 25,000. Wow, okay, all right, I put 25,000. Brooke? Oh God, my answer's gonna be like, okay. That is thinking, zero. <laughs> I was thinking like 250. All right, so we oh have a whole zero between God. you two. Oh my God, okay. All right, so I'm excited, let's get started. We're gonna go room by room, and so we're gonna start in the dining room, so okay. let's head this way. All right, so starting in the dining room. We don't have a big room. We got six chairs, they are on swivels. All right. Fancy. Nice round table, it is heavy as all day. Sure. And the rug is from Ruggables, because I need a rug that was flat, and then mm -hmm. you can, like, it's in a dining room so I can, like, wash it in the washing machine, okay. right? Yeah. Okay, so six chairs, they are on casters. Okay. Super heavy round dining table, and a rug. Okay, you start, so I'm gonna like, math in my head. Okay, <laughs> I got my cheat sheet, so we'll, we'll see what, where you I'm go. I'm gonna say, like, 4,500. What's your guess? Okay, I'm gonna go with 500 for the rug, 3,000 for the table, because I know it's super heavy and you are you. And I'm gonna go with, I don't know, $500 a chair. So 6,500. Okay. All right, so we get 65 and 45. Uh, Correct answer is $5,746. The rug is 480. Are these 400? The swivel chairs are 468 each. The round table is 24.58. So, okay. you shot too high, so Brooke wins. <laughs> Luck. All right, that's room one. Let's go to the kitchen. Oh, I'm excited about the kitchen. All right, so in the kitchen here, we have two bar stools. These are beautiful bar stools, custom leather barrel backs with this brass bottom. They're super comfortable to sit in. Then we have these chairs, four of them, they're armchairs. They actually match the same fabric as the other room. They were custom made in this really heavy dining table, and it's really heavy. Emily, you start this round. I am going to go two, two, three, four, I I'm gonna say 6,000. Okay, I'm gonna Bro. say 1,500, 1,500, so that's 3,000, and then 2,500 for that whole set. The correct answer is $8,034. Oh. Emily wins this one. Okay, you're, so we had bar stools were 1327 each. Each dining chair was 746 <laughs> each. And the dining table was just under $2400 at 2396 for a grand total of 8034. So, okay. two rooms were at a tie. Let's move to the sitting room. Okay, so this room's kind of divided in two. So I got my formal living and I got my sitting room and my family room area. So, for this one, we're doing just this coffee table. It is solid marble, it is super heavy. We have an all wool rug, four custom leather swivel chairs, two little side tables, and a giant mirror. 3,000 per custom leather swivel chair. Um, the coffee table, I'll say 3,000 too, and then the wool rug, 
1800 and side tables, 600 bucks, and then the mirror, I'll say $800. All right, your total is 18,200. Okay. That's like you a, stick with that? That's like a car, Adam. <laughs> All right, 18,200 was her. Where are you at? Okay, I'm gonna say two for each swivel chair. 200 each for each swivel. 2,000. 2,000, okay. okay. Uh -huh. All right, I have never in my life gone out to buy a, a solid marble coffee table. <laughs> um, but let's just say $1,000. Okay. Let's say $2,000 for the rug. Okay. And a mirror. I'm gonna say $1,200. Side tables. I, again, I have no idea. Those probably did not come from Amazon. So two, $200 each, $400. All right, so your total is 12,600. That's still like so a twelve thousand six hundred. Very nice vacation 18, somewhere. Eighteen thousand four hundred. <laughs> Technically, she's the closest, but she's just oh, over. No. The total was wow, seventeen thousand six seventy. All right, right, let's go through how we got there. You were pretty close on everything. Like with taxes, you would have been about right. Okay. That's All right. How it's going the swivel chairs were twenty-seven seventy-one each. The okay. plinth was three thousand two hundred and seventy-three dollars. The rug was 1600 so you were both close on the rug. Okay. The mirror was $1,271, oh, and the side I, tables were uh, 221 each. Did I have that one right for a change? You were pretty you close did. on that. <laughs> so, unfortunately, though, you were the closest. Yeah. You were just a hair too high, okay, and like, so Price is Right rules give Emily the slight edge two to one. Two Let's one. go to the living room. Okay, so we got two high wing backs. Okay, they are super heavy, real nice. Beautiful, tall gnarled floor lamps. Two of those. Okay. We have the same rug as we had before. So hint, can you remember how much that was? We have a coffee table. It's really heavy. We are going to include the pillows this time for fun. So we have six pillows on the couch and two over here. And these are leather, custom made to match the leather in the other rooms. We're going to include the library light this time above you. Okay. See if you can guess how much a library light is. And then we're going to do the two candlestick lights that are behind the couch. This is a lot of pressure. <sighs> I don't know. Okay, so we're doing the couch that you've had for a while. I'm going to say $2,000 for the couch. Are you adding this up? I'm adding it up. I'm going to say, what? <laughs> the rug. this was like 30 seconds ago, $1,600 for the rug. Okay. The two wing backs, I'm going to say $2,500 a piece. The monolith coffee table, super heavy, probably took a crane to get it into the house. $2,000, the fancy pants lights, $1,000 a pop. Okay. Uh, the library light, maybe you did a little high-low on that. So I'm gonna say maybe you just got that from, I don't know, internet source, let's say $100. Okay. And the pillows, are they from, I know the leather ones are not from Target, but what about all the others? All the other ones are actually from Target. Okay. Well done. Okay. Yeah. Nice. The leather so, ones are custom from RH. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. So 160 in the Target pillows, and I don't, I don't know how much an RH pillow costs. Let's, let's just, let's be sophisticated and say, like, um, I'm gonna say $600 each. We're missing just the uh -oh. two lamps here behind the couch. What do you think they are each? $200 each. All right, your grand total is 14,460. Brooke, it's your turn. Okay, no pressure. I'll start with the couch too. She okay. does this all day, uh, every day. This is not fair. Well, you're winning right now. Let's see if you can win. Uh, I know, I can't go over, that's my problem. Um, okay, sofa, I'm going to say 3,500. Okay. Um, I'll do the pillows on it too, let's say 120. Um, okay. The rug I know is 1600 because it's the same rug from the other room. Right. Coffee table, let's say 4000 The two wing back chairs, I'm going to guess 3100 per chair. Now I'm like, okay, I can't go over. Let's say 3000 per chair. The floor lamps, 1800 each. These four pillows, let's say a total of $300. The library light, I'll say um, 
Okay. And then the two floor lamps, $1,100 each. What? So your grand total, if I added it up right, was 21,620, does that sound right? Sure. Brooke, you were the closest, but However, still over again. <laughs> how far off the was that? The total is 18,636. So let's go ahead and do these. Each wing back with 2,921 each. The floor lamps were 907 each. The library light was 371. So you were pretty on and you were way off. I bet I could find something almost exactly like that for $100 and it would light up your picture just the same. We will take that challenge another day. <laughs> the coffee table is 2407. The rug is 1600. You both remember that from the last place. The pillows were a total of 1362. For a leather pillow. They're custom. They're <laughs> custom made. Okay. And then we have the two side lamps, which were 420 each. The couch was the shocker. The couch is only $4,000, which for a couch is actually a really good price. It's from Amazon that include delivery and they delivered it right here. So, Brooke, we got to get you back. You have a chance. Your cheapskate friend Emily is <laughs> going to win. <laughs> All right, let's go to the study. <laughs> All right, the study, this is gonna be fun. I actually, I'm really excited about the study. We're not even gonna do that much. I have this giant heavy desk. I have this chair on wheels. Okay. This is a Thayer Coggan shelter sofa. It's a 1970s classic. I know Brooke's smiling because she knows what it is. Okay. This is a classic sofa and it's a very iconic sofa. It's only two pieces, it's amazing. This really cool architectural lamp. And then for bonus, these two sculptures on the desk. Right. Let's start with our winner here, Emily. Oh my gosh, Adam. What are you, we gonna do? You're stressing me out. <laughs> <laughs> the iconic couch yes, from the 1970s yes. that apparently I need to Google some information about. The shelter sofa. It's something fancy. He is impressed with it. The designer knows what it's about. So I'm just gonna say $5,000, okay? Okay, we got a starting point. Um, what about the lamp? They're expensive. We're not talking Target. Let's go with $1,200. The super heavy desk. And Adam, have you had your floors structurally reinforced for all your super heavy furniture? It is heavy. <laughs> it took like four guys to get it in here. What do you think? Uh, I'm going to say $3,000. OK. The chair, which looks a lot like the dining room Good chairs. Good observation. Let's say $500. The sculptures. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this dude here $400 and I'm, I'm going to give the lady, let's give the lady more. Let's give her $500. Your grand total is $10,600 for the okay. things we identified. My whole house estimate, I must have been <laughs> ha hallucinating. Cause it's yeah. like her room. <laughs> yeah. All right. So $10,600. Brooke, you're up. Let's okay. start with the couch. Okay. It's a Thayer Coggin shelter sofa. I want to say like 10 or 11, but I also don't want to go above. So I'm going to say 9,000. Okay. Um, The desk, I will guess that it is 3,000. Okay. The chair, I do agree, very similar to the dining. And I think that was like 460. Okay. Um. I guess I should do this architectural floor lamp. I will guess that it is 1200. Okay. And then the two sculptures the and two you're done. Sculptures. This is giving me major anthropology vibes. Um, I'm going to guess it's $200. Okay. And that one is $200. Right. So $400. Your grand total is $14,060. Okay. You are so close and you are just barely under. Oh, so God. you get this point. <laughs> so it's now Good thing I didn't get three, point. you still have the lead to two. Okay. All right, so okay. the Thayer Coggin sofa, let's start there because yeah. everyone wants to know that is $8,814. The desk was 2,764. So you're both pretty close. Okay. The armchair, she guessed 460. It's 468. She had that like dead on. You guessed 500, which wasn't far off. The floor lamp is 1300. Oh, we were close on yeah. that too. And the sculptures were 750 each. Okay. We have two rooms left. And we'll see if it ends up at a tie. Let's go to the foyer. Okay. 
This is my favorite room. This is the last room on this floor. You, you're all gonna love this one because this is like, it's a pretty simple room. It's just a foyer entry, beautiful Carrera marble. This, this came in two crates from Italy. I just love this, this, this entry way. table. Uh, I think it was like 350 pounds. Like there was a, like six guys moving it in. All right, we have three mirrors. One small one here, two over there. Each one has a library light, a small one, two larger ones. And then the last couple items, another Ruggables rug, and two Ottomans. They're made out of velvet. They were custom ordered. So, Emily, you are still in the lead, so you're gonna start this. Let's start with the coffee table. I'm gonna say $2,000 for a table that really does nothing besides hold pretty things. I'm gonna say $200 for the mirror, for the little one, and $500 for the large. And then how about the library lights? There's three of them. Well, this one in the other room was $300, so I'm gonna okay. say $300 for that one. And the larger ones, I don't know, we'll bump it up to $400 each for those. Okay. Okay. A couple items left. The lovely camel cubed ottomans. Um, I'm gonna say $500 each and the little rug. Um, 250. Okay. Total of $5,550 is your total. Okay. Brooke, it's your turn. Okay. We gotta get the tie back. I think you can I do know. this. I know, okay, this is my chance. This okay, my let's start with here. Where are you at? She did 2,000. It's real marble. And it's beautiful. It's very stately. I want to say it's probably higher than this, but for me winning sake, I'm gonna say like 4,000. That Perfect. mirror, let's go with. 600. Okay. That scant, I'll also say $300. Okay. The larger uh, picture lights, I'll say 800 each. Each, okay. And then um, the larger mirrors, 600. Each? Yeah. Ottomans, $500 each. Okay. And the ruggable rug, I'll say $200. All right, your total is $8,900. And you were at 5550 are you ready for this? $16,309. You've lost your mind. <laughs> you have lost well, your mind. Well, let's see where it all added up. Okay, so then we have $1,600 for the mirror. What? We have $1,900 for each mirror over here. So then we have the, <laughs> the Ottomans. Actually, let's start down here on the Ottomans. The Ottomans were $1,196 each because they're beautiful velvet and velvet costs more and they have a nice brass base. All right, the library lights, 371 on the small one. So you were pretty close. I think you were too. I was 300, two. yeah. The large ones were only 446 each. I think oh. you went 800 yeah. each. Yeah. And then the Ruggables is actually only $180. Nice. So there we have it. We now have a tie. This is perfect. We couldn't have planned this better. And we have one room left, the bedroom. So let's do the primary. All right, this room will be fun. This is our last room. This is a chance for either of you to win. Okay. So here's what we have. Just the bed frame. This is Sigorsky crystals in it. Beautiful frame, goes all the way around. My wife picked it out. We have a credenza here. We have two nightstands. We have two lamps that are like those candle ones downstairs. We have two, and these are solid marble. Oh my God, they're heavy. Lamps here. And we have this beautiful rug. Brooke, let's let you start this one. Okay, I was afraid you were gonna say that. I'll start with the rug. Okay, what do you got? Is it from Target? It is not from Target. Uh, okay. It is partially, almost, I think it's like 90% wool. I was gonna say, what's wool? Um, I'm going to guess $2,000. Okay. Um, The bed frame, I will say $2,000. No, let's go $2,500. Okay. The pair of nightstands, I'm gonna say 2100 per nightstand. Okay. The table, the table lamps, I'm trying to think of what the floor lamps were in the main living. I'll say $300 each. All right. I think I way overestimated the main living space. And then it's just these pairs. These two lights here. Okay, um, $900 each. The credenza, let's go with 3,000. All right, so 14,100. Do you want to go yeah. with it? Yeah. All right, let's so. do it. Okay. Last up, Emily. All right, I'll start with the rug. I love the rug. Yeah. Um, you said it's mostly wool. 
I'm going to say $1,600 for the rug. Okay. Just the bed frame, not the mattress or... No, nope, nope, okay. just the frame. Um, let's go with $2,000 for the bed frame. Okay. Each side table, I'm going to give a price of $1,600 per side table. Okay. The lamps, which complement the ones downstairs, um, I'm going to say $800 a piece. The credenza with the awesome hardware on it, $4,000. And the lamps, um, $300 each. Okay, so that brings you to around $13,000. It's so close. Oh. Both dead on. She's a little higher. So, the final number is 11,662. Oh, you both overshot it. All right, so here's where the final numbers came out. We had the bed, 4,700, the okay. Skorsky crystals. Then we had the two nightstands. They were 1,286 each for a total of 2,572. You're, you're close on those. Credenza was 2,300. I think that was a little far off. Yeah. The marble lamps were 230 each, so 460. The nightstand lamps were 265 each for a total of 530, and the rug was 1,100. So uh, nobody got any points on this one. How are we going to fix this? Well, we're going to have to go back to what we said the original budget was. Do you remember this? Where'd oh, you start? Yeah. Um, embarrassingly low. I think I said 25,000. I think so too. <laughs> and you said? I was like 25,000 per room, eight you, rooms. You or like I said 250. 250. But that's way over. So neither of you are right. <laughs> And you're very far off, so I'm going to give you the opportunity at everything you looked at today to take a couple seconds to re-guess. To re-guess. You have this opportunity to be the winner and re-guess. So the final number is? 100K. And you're going to go, where you, so you well, went down 150. Obviously, I need to come way, way up. I'm going to say 75,000. The final number is 92,903. So you are so close once again. Yeah. And if you added tax and shipping and everything, you're probably dead on, but you're over. And so <laughs> as much as I am surprised, Emily wins this one. Now here's, here, here's some things, some takeaways that I learned. Yeah. First of all, I think the whole goal of this was to talk about how much furniture costs. Because I don't think people yeah. realize how much furniture costs. And it costs a lot for really good pieces. It isn't to say that you can't get cheaper pieces at Target or Ikea or other places. You can, but the quality goes down. So depending on like, your plan, like are you gonna be there for a couple of years or is this gonna be a piece that you're gonna own for your entire life? You wanna think about those things. But the other thing is, I actually, when you go room by room, it adds up quick. But when you think about the whole house for under 100,000, that's not that bad mm -hmm. to have all nice luxury furniture. So, I was shocked at that final number. But room by room, yeah, it adds up. I appreciate both of you for coming. If you enjoyed watching this video, make sure to check back for more. Subscribe to my channel. Make sure to check out Brooke's channel. She has a great Instagram channel that just has so many great tips on designer, uh, anything interior design. And then Emily puts out these great videos about Iowa City on YouTube, so check out her YouTube. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time. We have a problem. I hit the wrong button on my calculator and I lost count.